Hello, this is Just Cry. Welcome back to another episode of Terraria. As you can see, I uh, built an extension to my house here. I want to make uh, generators for liquids, and I'll show you how they activate. I'll activate this one. I'm not sure if these actually do multiply the liquids. I uh, used a. Uh, this is a. Uh, yeah, the. Yeah, this one is a uh, three times multiplier. I was messing around with circuits and I found out that if you set up the wires in this pattern, and you, whatever number you use, they ha all have to be the same number. Whatever number you use, they'll be multiplied it by three times. Like this circuit activates every nine seconds. This one, every 15 seconds. There's also another one where uh, they're in the same position, but if you uh, take this blue wire and switch it for a green, then it just doubles the time, where this one would then activate for six seconds. This one every six seconds, I mean. This one activate every ten. But yeah, I'm using this to create lava. Yeah, I don't know if I should... Yeah, I'll leave it there. It'll be fine. I can get it through the wall. I'm still, uh... Eventually, I already have, uh... You can see that pump there. That's an input pump. Uh, basically, there's input pump input pumps here connected to output pumps there so every time it pulses input output same with here input there output there it's moving a lava from the bottom to the top but it somehow creates more every time it does it and I have it sort of on a platform here to sort of like spread out how much it goes down so it slowly drips it down and every time it's split it's like every time it's split it rounds up so you get up more that way as well then how does it fill all the way to the top, I don't know. But apparently they work. I've just seen people do pyramid designs first, and the theory behind it, so I just made my own, and apparently it seems to work, so I must have done something right. Uh, I'll leave that on. Oh, and la uh, after last episode, I accidentally, when I was just uh, messing around trying to get keys, I have six gold keys now, I found a king slime, so I'm actually going to uh, cut to the little uh, clip that I recorded then. Okay, I don't know what I did, but king slime apparently has awoken. Huh, he's just stuck in there. Let's see if I can wear him down from up here. Uh, oh, I forgot. I'm using the Lee equipment. Let's see if I can. Uh, Getting close. Three. Ouch. Oh, at least those guys drop hearts. I'm hoping if I use melee, I'll do more damage and finish take him down quicker. Yeah, I don't know why. I was just running along, going into the dungeon to farm keys. This is, you know, right after I record my last episode, and this happened. So I figure I'm just going to stick it into my next episode and actually show off the King Slime fight. Normally you have to make an item for these. I don't know how on earth he triggered. Oh, ow. Ow, kill him quickly before I die. Whew, that was not good. Let's see if I can wear him down. Wait, I'm wearing my Crimson Armor. That means if I just get a little bit away from him... I got ninja shirt. Yeah, there's a ninja set that you can only get for by defeating him. And every time you defeat him, you can get one of the pieces. Gets a bit annoying if you have two out of three pieces and the third one just won't drop. Ninja shirt. That's what it looks like. Uh, I'll showcase the entire set. But back to farming. Okay, I'm back again. And yeah, uh, I think I put it in here. Yeah, ninja shirt. So let's head back to the dungeon. I mean, there's still more stuff at my base. Oh, I still need to use all that silt. I'll eventually we'll get around to it. But I'm working with that uh, system, and I pretty much used all the stone I have, building all the walls, the bricks, and everything. I mean, maybe I didn't have to make them so big, but still. 
I'm happy with the way they look. And eventually I'm going to have a system that will uh, combine the different uh, types of liquids together. Because uh, for that one guy's house, I need to uh, get more uh, honey blocks, which you get by combining honey and water. And there's crisp honey, which is honey and lava, and obsidian, which is lava and water. And I'm going to see if I can make a system where you just flip a switch and then whatever liquid you want will uh, go down. But I'm thinking of making it even more efficient, where instead of just uh, creating one block at a time, it'll actually create like an entire row that you can just mine up easily. Yeah, you could... Nah, that's what I should do. Underneath it. Yeah, I have a couple ideas how to do it. But here we are again. Oh, I forgot I can take fall damage. I will eventually loot this area. I didn't do any more exploring. Just uh, fought in the area that I was in. But I need uh, more wiring as well. <laughs> so I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to take apart all these. I'll grab the switches. Wait, was there any more up here? You know, I'll do this off camera, or unless maybe if I see a trap that I want to disable, instead of uh, mining it up, I might just take out the uh, the wires. Okay, where was a chest? I know there's a few chests that I had that I couldn't open. Uh, I am right. I think we already got one. Flaming arrow. Take it all. I can't remember if there's anything else. I forgot that uh, you could get a blue moon here. Maybe if I stay back. Shadow key. Suspicious looking eye. I can take up use all those. Tell if there's a chest down here or not. Oh yeah, I was gonna combine the uh, uh, obsidian skull with a cobalt shield. I got around to doing that either. Ah, yes. a statue there I need to grab. Let's this place up. There we go. Statue. I wonder if that does anything. Trees. Ah. Oh. oh, I was gonna make the armor as well. I'm really running out of them fast. Get that. Mine up that stand. 
statue. Oh, it's a strange looking chest. Oh, dungeon slime. Whatever it's called. Another key. Dungeon slime, yep. Thank you. One, but another eye. Excellent. Silver. Always useful. I use the silver for the three second timers. I wouldn't open that way. Or maybe there was something there. People on the back wall, if those are Countess paintings or what? Hanging skeleton. Well, something like that. I can pick them up. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Hide well. Shield, Splunker Potion, that's useful. You know what, if I already grab some of those, let's grab some more. Do they stack, right? Ah, yes they do. I don't need this rope, I don't need this bone one. I won't need either. Okay, we've explored over here. Let's head over to this side. Nope. Denied. Come on, give me more keys. I think I might be out of keys. that. It's a weird looking key. I, I know you need like key molds from like separate areas. It's all like later game stuff. To access those. Well, uh, that's the extent of my knowledge. You get key molds later on, you make keys. It's not exactly in depth. want these mana potions. Just in case I decide to use magic. And I don't stop. And that's up here. Oh yes, another one. Area off. Oh wait. Another thing I meant to do, I need to buy a piggy bank. And a safe. Two po if possible. Ah, different background. Yeah, I heard that different monsters spawn for different backgrounds, don't know how that works whatsoever, or if it actually is a thing. Die. Ow. <laughs> oh wait, I'm barely taking any damage. Ah, oh, another bone one. Really? Die. Because they 
do seem to be spawning a lot faster now. Ah, another chest. Die. And open another one right there. Ooh, I want this. Get rid of that. 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 Ooh, I add up magic missile. Nice. place I haven't been is to my left. Oh. Now let's finish off all these guys. That looks like a really nice painting in the background. Definitely gonna have to come back my off time and loot all the paintings. Oh yeah, I need to get all the water candles. What can I get rid of? Oh. Candles and that potion. Oops, nope. There we go. I should no longer have water candle buff. Nope. Excellent. No, no place for the angel statue. Ah. Uh, I really want the mana potions. Oh, a golden key. More gold keys. Can't get that chest either. Is that another... Oh! Pink dungeon candle. another water candle. I think that's everything. I wish I could pick up that chest just for completion's sake. Yeah, I'll see if I've got anything else. No, that's pretty much every place in the dungeon explored, yes. here anyway. So I'm just going to hang up a light right here. There we go. That will let me get this chest. And I am out of here. Nice. More statues. Oh, I had a bunch of those, but at least one new one. Corrupt. The only entire chest full of them. I eventually need to hook up the bunny statue to a timer. Or, do I have a goldfish statue yet? No. no, not yet. I need a goldfish statue. Might have to go more statue hunting. <laughs> okay. Items. That's for selling. Keeping this one, because I like to keep two of everything. I, I thought I. Oh, there it is. Traveling merchant has arrived. Put you there. Okay, the skeleton, I guess you go in here as well. Uh, wait, wasn't it in this chest where I had. Okay, that one's better, so I will take you and put you there. And where was that? There it is. Yeah. I can just make... have another shield. 
Ah, two defense, plus three percent damage. What should I get rid of that? Ooh, that's plus three defense, but need a knockback. Need to fire block. So that's what I want. Ruler, yeah, I was measuring things. No, oh yeah, I was putting it in this chest. All my, like, contraption items and usable items. Alchemy Lantern. Uh, switches and the wires will go in here. And ingots. I think that's everything. Well, except potions. And I'll just sell those. How did I... Oh, I stored all my money. I was like, what happened to all my money? I must have gotten some while I was down there. There we go. Need some more. And store. Yeah, I spent a bit reforging. Uh, I want something better on this. You know what? Maybe we'll just try a bit of reforging. I'm not going to use that much gold. How much would it cost to reforge this? Uh, maybe try it once. Precise. No, guarding. Oh, huh, there we go. Haha, <laughs> nice. Got a shield in front of him now. Okay, what should we do next? Oh, I wanted to also make an item. I'll just take all these. I don't know how many it takes. So I'm just going to make a whole bunch of lead. Eleven enough? Twenty should be enough. Glass kill. Use for special crafting. Won't fit there. Can I? Nah. I need to get rid of some of these things. Put you there. Ooh, that's pretty big. And I think I can make, I, if I need like sand or something, but I'll have to look into what recipes I can make with that. Uh, and quickly, I mean, there's three butterflies, maybe one of these is one I haven't gotten before. Let's find out. Nope, had them all. And why is that gold there now? There we go. Now we need to, more stone to finish this. We are done the dungeon, so that means hell is the next spot we go. I also might work on mushroom farm off camera. Yeah, let's go to the mushroom farm. I'm gonna probably just, uh, this is actually pretty nice. I'll clear out this area, add mud in like layers, and that way hopefully it'll grow onto it. So hopefully next episode you can see that. That guy taking damage. Let's start digging down. I also want to proceed onward so I'll get more stone so I can finish up the combination, uh, the uh, liquid combiner I'm making. Because uh, I'm making it a certain way. I've seen a few people make some, but not the way I'm making it. I'm gonna see if I can actually only use one outlet and just have like a bunch color color colored wires hooked into it. I don't know why I wanna make it that way, I just think it'll be fun. Okay, I need light. Why is there no light? I think I might have spilled some water or something. Yeah. Ah, 
I'm just gonna spill the water downward. Thank you. Oh yeah, the die trader. I don't know what I'm gonna do for his home. But I need to buy the die back because I want to start working on dies. I've collected quite a few materials. At least this episode we managed to finish off the dungeon. Wait, the armor! Wait, Ashley. That's what I was going to do. Quick stack. Creature droppings. Uh, keep the blocks. The golden keys are consumable items. I might use them in another world. Ashley. Shadow key will keep on me. Uh, hmm. Let's grab a whole bunch of these and a whole bunch of these. Okay, it's five, six, five, and I have six, seven, six. What? Really? It's not better. I'm gonna make it anyway. Wonder what the bonus is. chance not to consume ammo. Increased range damage, increased range damage, increased range damage. What weapons do I have? Ranged ones. 28, 16, 32 range damage, and that's only 19. Yeah, that plus this. If I ever need to use ranged weapons, I'll probably use this set. Just for fun, I shall wear it now. It still has that blurring effect. Ah, oh, crap, he left. Wait, I think I need a duck? Or a regular one? Mallard. Did I have one of these, or was it the other one I needed? Because I know there's still one duck I'm missing. Must be the other one I'm missing. Ah, oh, I need a mannequin to store all this stuff on. Yeah, I need to finish building this area so I can move that, because there I want to have like a giant uh, showcase for all my armor. I think that looks pretty cool. And down we go. But yeah, less defense. It does give me more range damage, and for the last boss, I know I'm definitely going to go ranged. Yeah, I think I might just try using the uh, one of the guns on him. How low am I? Oh crap, I'm only like... Actually, it's not bad. I'm guessing lava stops there. I'm guessing it's around here where I'll stop. So just one, a little bit more. Of course, that is a guess, so. For all I know, it could be a lot longer. Ah, do I have any dirt? Good. Nope. I'm <laughs> just checking to see if there's any. Uh. 
guys around me. Oh yeah, and I might see if I can make an arena. I got a bone sword? What the? 13 melee damage. An annoying... Wait. That has reduced damage. I wonder what that does at full. Huh. Cool. Another weapon I didn't know existed. Yeah, just a little bit of water. Shouldn't matter that much if it leaks out. Oh, it just leaks out into another uh, bigger area, so that's fine. Yeah, put that there. There you go, that should be fine then. Hopefully this episode I can reach hell. What is that? Oh, amethyst. I should look into what I can make more with those, because I have quite a bit of gems now. Ah, here we go. Wait, why am I mining in the dark? Whoa! It's not what I meant to do. Wonderful, I flooded my little area. So I'll just hit lab and I'll just get a bunch of obsidian. I wonder if I could use obsidian to make a room. Hmm, might be an idea. Ah, uh, this is gonna flood that area. But yeah, I want to make a uh, arena to attract sharks, because they have a drop chance of dropping a diving helmet, which is an item I want. I don't really need it, but I want it. And uh thing about the diving helmets that's a pretty rare drop, so I want to make an arena to attract sharks, at, uh, attract sharks, trap them, and then kill them with dart traps. I'll do this and hope that doesn't fill up too much. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Where did my torch go? There it is. Definitely needed that torch back. <laughs> Once I hit lava, it'll uh, all turn into obsidian. Or if it actually hits the very bottom area, I think it just evaporates. Watch my oxygen, and all this stone is definitely going to help me uh, finish up that place. as well. Ow. Oh, I'm underwater. Shoot, there's a timer. We're out of time. Uh, there we go. Ah, oh, come on, stay on the top one. because I think I'm very close to the, uh, I forget what it's called, but I'll just call it hell. 
the underworld. Yeah, that's one reason why I want the diving helmet. And it lets you hold your breath for longer. Uh, how close am I? I'll just save it for next episode, exploring the underworld and getting there. So I'm going to end the episode here. If you like, like, subscribe. If you don't, don't. But hope to see you next episode. Take care.